Yo, 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 it's Deck 612 I recently picked up this 2007 Toyota Camry Hybrid for $800. This car was the highest trim level Toyota Camry that came out that year, $25,000 brand new. How did I get the car for $800, you may ask? Well, let's roll the clip. So yeah, the engine is no good. The story is that the previous owner ran the car drive oil. It happens, it is what it is. There's actually a bit of a hole in the block. I'll show the picture here. Pinhole, a little rod, poked a little hole in the block. It's a 2.4 liter, four cylinder, automatic transmission with a hybrid electric motor. The car is good. It has minor dents and scratches here and there. No significant body damage. I bought this car directly from the previous owner. It was in a tight spot in the driveway. I knew I had to drive the car out of there really fast. Uh, before the engine completely broke. I had to get the car out to the street so that my tow guy could be able to load it up and get it out of there ASAP. I was in such a rush that I probably caused more damage to this car than, than what was on there before. I bashed the rear bumper cover into the retaining wall on the side of the driveway, scuffed up the lower bumper cover. It is what it was. Good thing it's down low so it's not really visible from up top. I also put a crack in the tail light when I was trying to push the car around. We bought this car on January 1st, New Year's Day. No one was working that day. None of the tow guys, anything. I had to call up my tow guy. This guy's loyal. I use him all the time. And this is where loyalty pays off. It's not just in the auto industry, it's in any industry. If you find someone who does a good job for you, you stick with that person, okay? You don't go shop around every single time. You stay loyal, because if you stay loyal to the business, eventually the business will start being loyal to you. So here's what happened. So you guys remember, I sold the last truck, so I don't have a truck right now. He's like, how much you want to pay? I'm like, dude, if you can do it today for 200 bucks, he's like, yeah, I'll do it, I'll do it. Anybody else would have just hung up the phone on me. That's why you stay loyal, my friends. Anyway, back to the car. So you guys are going to want to stay tuned because this is the beginning of a video series on this Toyota Camry Hybrid. If you like the sound of it, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button, share this video. I've always liked these Toyota Camrys. I like how they look. Everybody likes them. Toyotas are expensive. I was never able to get one. I remember a couple years ago, I was looking at a, it was a 2007 Camry at the auction. I remember I wanted to win it so bad and then uh, it got bid up. It just got bid up, up, up to 3,500 bucks and that was before fees and taxes. That tells you how much these cars have depreciated over the years. So buying this car for 800 bucks was a great deal, even with the issues. So... Y'all stay tuned. This car has a lot of problems, and we're going to fix them all. It's going to be a nice car when we're done with it, and we're going to make some money. Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this video. Stay tuned for the next one. I'm grinding. I hope you all are doing the same. Y'all stay strong, stay healthy, stay inspired. I'm out. God bless.